What is going on Guardians? Sofax here with my very first video. And it's on the fusion rifle long far gone. I was looking on the web for a, vi a video review and didn't really find one so I thought I'd give it a shot and make my own. I've never really liked fusion rifles but when Taken King dropped and I had the shotgun from the quest reward already, I decided to give it a go. Long Far Gone takes about maybe three seconds to charge, which isn't bad. It has six rounds, so you're not reloading every few seconds, and a pretty high reload speed of about two seconds. I ran the daily, her daily heroic mission with it primarily as my weapon and didn't have any issues with downtime on charge and reload speed. Impact isn't the highest for fusion rifles that I've noticed, but it doesn't take anything away from this gun you're still doing a good amount of damage on it. It's an effective mid-range gun. You won't be hitting anything very well at long range, but if you're trying that, you should probably pick a, use a sniper rifle instead. Build, ability is average. If you want more, you're gonna wanna grab the brace frame perk. I currently have the fusion rifle ammo perk on a piece of gear, which gives you 34 total rounds. I heart, with that, I hardly ever have any ammo, ammo problems. I really am liking this gun with how it handles and how smooth it is. I just really like it. I'm currently on it running the MD Reflex, which significantly improves handling. Surrounded, this weapon gains bonus damage when three or more enemies are in close proximity, which I find comes in very, in very handy. Quick draw, this weapon can be drawn unbelievably fast. I'm using this because I don't really like the other two perks very much. Brace frame, you gain stability, but reduce mag size. So if you're wanting more stability, if you don't think the stability on it is that great or to your liking, you can grab that, but you're gonna have fewer rounds to fire before you have to reload. Thankfully, that reload speed is still high, so you're not taking forever to reload on it. You have more you're going to want to use this perk if you want base, higher stability than just the base. Last in the row, sort of Aegis, I think it's called, I don't know. Bonus damage against Vex Minotaurs. I haven't paid, paid attention to the exact amount of damage, but I didn't really notice the difference. I was still dropping Minotaurs pretty fast. It didn't like it freaking make it skyrocket, so I'm not too sure. Lastly, Eye of the Storm. Weapon becomes more accurate as your health gets lower. To me, Surrounded and Eye of the Storm goes pretty well together, since usually if your health is low, there's at least three enemies around you. Overall, I think this is a great gun. I give it seven out of 10 out of the fusion rifles that I've used, and seven out of 10 for special weapons. I mean, I've used quite a few shotguns, but they all seem to have a slower reload speed and not as many rounds as they used to. Well, that's all I got for this video, Guardians. Like, comment, share below. Until next video, stay classy, Guardians.